Welcome back to my channel. My name is Madison if you're new here and today's video is going to be a prep for my birthday weekend. So my birthday was Monday and we are celebrating this weekend. It is currently Friday. So tomorrow is Saturday and we're going out to eat at Forno which is on Short North in Columbus and it is amazing. <laughs> I love Forno. It is like the best food and it's just so cute in there. I'm so excited. And I already have outfits planned. Let me actually show you my outfits. So for dinner, I'm wearing a dress. And then to go out, I'm wearing a little top. So this is what I'm wearing to dinner. It's like a shimmery little moment. See her? It's like so pretty, okay. So that's what I'm wearing to dinner. And this is what I'm wearing to go out. Just a little bralette moment. Very sparkly. So the first thing that I need to do to prep for tomorrow is do my nails. I just picked them all off yesterday. I had brown polish on. And I picked them off because I got anxious in class. So we are grabbing my nail stuff right now. We also have to do my toenails. We have to shower, shave, exfoliate and do my spray tan, so, whoa, lighting. So I'm gonna do my nails, hold on. Okay, so I'm in my living room and I just set up all my nail stuff. Um, I'm gonna show you the best brand of gel polish ever. It's Beatles Gel Polish from Amazon. I'm gonna link it down below so that you can literally buy it, cause it's amazing. I also got this really wonky little LED light from Amazon. Um, I think I'm going to do hot pink French tips. I don't really know how it's going to go. I usually test it out just on my thumb finger first to see if I like it. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to do a speed through of me doing my nails. So enjoy this. I decided to just go with all pink because the French tips were so difficult. So, this is what we're doing. Update. <clears throat> It's a little bit later, and I'm filing some toenails. If you don't know me in person, you probably wouldn't know the fact that I don't have big toenails. Whoa, I just dropped my toenail. Um, I used to play volleyball in high school, and apparently the trauma of like my foot hitting the front of my shoe all the time very detrimental for your toenails so oh they're like growing back you know but they're not not the vibe i put these little bad boys on you can see how cute it is i've been filing it and trying to make it like look normal on my toe and i'm just gonna paint it a white color because that's what my toes are right now so i would show you this but <laughs> I'm not showing my feet on the internet. Also, how cute are my nails? Hello. I love them. I'm obsessed. Okay, I was sitting here and I realized that I don't have um, an exfoliator to get off my tan, which is very crucial because I still have like some remaining self tanner that I did like a few days ago and I need it completely off because I need a fresh start. So... It's currently 7.20, and we're gonna go to Ulta. Also, my fit is hilarious. What is that? Ew. Okay, let's go to Ulta, baby. Got back a little bit ago from Ulta. I really just wanted to clean up my apartment and get all that crap done, 
clearly sweating my butt off and yeah um i picked up a duncan because i knew i was gonna be up late and i'm gonna give you a little ulta haul i literally got two things actually three i got a birthday gift baby this is the clinique moisture surge auto replenishing hydrator i think i have this in a big version um and then i got tree huts girl this is my favorite scent it's green tea smells incredible literally go to ulta just to smell this and then i got the morphe setting spray i just got a little one i think i'm gonna go shower and shave and exfoliate and do the whole nine yards and prep my skin for my tan i'm gonna show you exactly how i self tan but let's go shower first so i'll see you after i'm out of the shower i look like a ghost in this lighting um showered shaved exfoliated my skin feels absolutely incredible but i'm gonna brush out my hair i use the it's a 10 miracle leave-in product and then i'm putting on the olaplex number six I look so pale. I'm gonna do the Zit Stika Press Refresh Hydro Gel Exfoliating Sheet Mask. This is one of my favorite masks ever. ASMR. Nice. Oh, that's freezing. I look like Batman. This feels incredible. Okay, I'm gonna go fold my laundry and then I will see you when I take this off. Did I do mm, any laundry? No. I sat here and filmed the beginning part of my transition for all my TikToks that I'm gonna make tomorrow. So it's time to mask off. Oh, that feels so oh. <coughs> Ew! It like stuck. The corner. I look like the Walmart version of Batman. <sighs> that feels incredible. And then you're just supposed to like rub in the excess um, like serum. My friend Whitney gave me a cute little birthday basket and she put these eye gels and lip mask on it. So that's what we're using. Okay, I rinsed off my face and took off that extra serum stuff. And now I'm just putting on my Curology. My skin feels so soft though. And then I take this Clarisol. Frankie chewed it, as you can see. It's called the Emergency Blemish Relief. So I kind of load it up. Um, and then I'm taking some Aquaphor. My tanning routine used to be so complex and annoying. I literally used to use a mitt and everything and it was just so extra. I found a product that gives me like better results than a mousse does. It is the Vita. Don't mind the fact that it's a travel size. My mom has the full size, and I let her keep it, and she gave me the little one. Vita Liberata Tanning Elixir, okay? Is I take, like, that much. By the way, I already moisturized my elbows, my wrists, and my hands. And then I just rub her in. It develops in, like, eight hours. I don't know if you can see a difference. That's pretty much all I do. Um, and then I put this shiz all over my body. I also put some on my face too. I'm gonna let my Clarisol soak in a little bit and then I'll show you how they soaked in my face. I did my whole body and now I'm gonna put a little bit on my fingers for my face. Literally nothing special. Just do the exact same thing that I did on my body. Look at the difference. Now I like to get palms of my hands wet so they're not orange the prep i'm going to be doing for the rest of the night um i will be vlogging tomorrow i don't know how much footage we're going to get but i'm going to try and vlog a lot 
make sure you follow me on instagram and tiktok because i'll be posting a ton of content from this weekend thank you for watching today's video i hope you guys really enjoyed it and hopefully you learned a few things too you subscribed if you aren't already and i will see you in my next video bye